I'm, I, I'm really curious. I wonder if that has like the exact opposite bet. I can't look at the ball cap right now. So I need to, I need to cash in this one. I guess. Fairweather T five hundred. Show me the money. Remember that weakness you were looking for. Plus three high guard and armor. enemies with. Like, maybe what? it can that only stop small, a fast weird tiles, bonus. But a large, There's a lot to unpack up, from that bonus shattering. because one, it means or we're gonna get into a fight at some point. Maybe or it, it could just be a joke. Melt. Or personal favorite. Or it could be a, or Frequency it could be a joke. Something radio weapon. None of that would work. You need to shoot the part of the enemy that doesn't have fear with a T500 on it, because the armor itself is invulnerable. Good news is, so are the armor pieces on you. That's not like decent armor. All right, well, real quick, we can look. Oh hmm. my God, I got two new thoughts. I don't know where to put them. To empathy, cold blooded for indirect modes of That makes sense. Okay. The cap plus one gives you minus two to empathy while you're learning about it. That's <laughs> fair. Okay. Alright, well, um. I guess we can talk to that lady again and just say, hey! I, yeah. have, a, I do Are have you... a crowbar in my hand. I'm not afraid to use it if I gotta. Someone's pointed the finger at you. Movie star. Make way for the master poet. Okay, I figured maybe this guy would just have new dialogue about the lady driver. So I don't want to talk about that. You were right. Oh. Oh. Okay. Uh, that that he immediately goes like, uh, never mind. Don't don't talk Man, to me. I was hoping it isn't gonna be her. All I can say is, she isn't around here anymore. She isn't some evil drug trafficker, and I don't know where she is. Huh. Okay. I did it, man. I told you I was hoping it's not her. That she wouldn't be mixed up in it. It's true. We would have caught a lie. But a kind heart is tricky. Hmm. Bah. Emotional rhetoric. He knew something and he didn't share it with you. That's a fact. Um, hey. Rhetoric, you're talking to drama there, so... Get your fucking yeah. hands straight, dude. Uh, nice. Thank God I don't know. People here call her the Lady Driver. She kept her name a secret. From me, too. Now I see why. Okay. A friend? She's already the yeah. coolest character in the game. I don't know. Yeah. She was the only person in this damn jam I could talk to. I wonder if she's the one she's who bought the gun. I don't gun. Want to out to the law, okay? Maybe. Since, all, since we still know that a woman bought the gun from the pawn shop. A youngish Maybe. woman. Maybe. Gruff, but in a cool way. This, like okay. Maybe I'm... Blue and violet. Died. Blue and oh, violet. I don't know. Blue was violet when she got here. Blue before she went. Okay, what I mean, it sounds like she changed. It, it doesn't matter what her hair color was if she changes it frequently. Yeah. Okay. Because before that, I was gonna say again. maybe it's bias because we've already spouted our theory out. But like, gruff, but in a cool way. Sounds like that. Yeah. Sounds like that first lady we met. Damn, I don't want to. Please just let. And. Go. Whatever I like your theory did, about her buying the gun. And she's not a bad classic I know that much. criminal move from television shows, go talk to the cop right away. And she was the first person we talked to. Yeah. We can't just let it go. It's part of a police investigation. That's how it always is with you, isn't it? All part of the investigation. The girl's troubled. If you hunt her down, she may not survive it. What? I can't have that on my conscience. What does that even mean? It won't come to that. We won't pursue her on this. This is information. Yeah, that's. Money. I don't that's believe. That's a lot you. to unpack. She she's she's got the darkness in her. That young person's darkness when you think it's all over. And you're looking for a way out. Mm. She shared this she's... with you? Oh. Yes. Which is why I don't want to snitch on her. Uh, I thought everyone's afraid of her. You're not... I heard the rumors. I saw the other drivers looking at me strange when we talked, and she told me too, that she's had a violent life, but I wasn't afraid of her, more like for her. Did this violent life include drug trafficking? Well, okay. it looks like it did now, but we didn't mm -hmm. talk about that. We talked about life, you know? She talked about her mind, the way it worked, the trouble it was giving her. Oh, okay. The pain it was causing her. Okay. Fuck, man. Okay. We'll grow someone else with these questions, okay? There are plenty of drivers here who couldn't stand her. Or were well, now we gotta her. find this girl to make sure They'd she's okay. They'd be more than happy to rat her out. 
You so know? she's a cool badass with depression. Got it. He's yes. Right. Yeah. There are other options. The race man for one. Mm. Exactly oh, where yeah, I've landed. Woman. Maybe she knows something. Wait, this guy says they're friends. Then acquaintances. And he's okay with others ratting her out. Now is not the time to focus on feelings. You Jeez, need everyone's info, coming in for a piece of the party here. God damn. Um mm. Sure, with others ratting her out. There's on my trees, I need this. She's a suspect, you need to tell me where she is. I can't. I don't want to force Tommy, I like Tommy. Alright, let's just too. say, uh, others are gonna rat her out, Fine. I guess. I don't want to be a butcher. And I don't want to be a knight either. I just want to be a person who can sleep at night. A little fame wouldn't hurt, too. So not I wish one of these options. If you blow it, are you? Because she's on the edge, man. Hey, man, I've already done that. I wouldn't be so What's sure, to me? Tommy. All right, I don't want to force him. Thank so. you, friend. Yeah, no. I wish one of those options was. <sighs> wow. Less. This makes me feel like I should pick up smoking like, again. I don't know. It less aggressive. Like I wish one of those options was just like, hey, like, you said some red flags. I want to go find out if this person's okay. Can you help? I mean, that's what Kim said, though. So, I just wanted to ask questions. And I guess like, that's no. true. The woman. I guess it's true. Huh? Let's get her attention. What is it? Um, what do you want? Are you the lady driver? Can you just call me a lady, Harifa? That's what a woman driver is. Like I'm here. not that either, Harifa. I've gone too far from it all to remember what was between my legs. It doesn't work like that on the long haul. Okay. I'm only terrifying sure. to small children. And to those who used to know me. Yeah, okay. it's not her. Believe me. Um, yeah, but then, we want to know. Then who is the female? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do I look like I spend a lot of time with the other commoners sniffing around? When I have my movies That's a good to point. go to. The big ones, the trucks. The pale driver just loves movies. It's all just. Yeah. In the middle of this town, there's a ghostly motorway. It takes all the people where they want to stay. You feel very cold suddenly, as if standing face to face with a terrifying adversary. She's then summoning a ghost. The dissipates, and all you see is an aging woman. I'm gonna need to put her down. In the background, a quiet song mm -hmm. seeps from her cabin into the air. You don't hear any vocals. Because they can no longer recognize the person I once was. All right, well. Uh, good. Have good a good talk. day. Good, good talk. Next. Enjoy, enjoy the film. All right. Well, let's get back to this, this guy, I guess. I'm starting to get worried. The only path oh, forward is for something on his hand. Yeah. Me to fuck off again? That's up. Where's the lady driver? I don't driver? know what you're talking about. Uh, uh you knew he said it. Did something. He stole his employer's goods and another lorry man's job. You should be thankful for the tip. Oh, all right then. Uh, why are you smirking? Listen up, MF? fuckwits. You don't hey. scare me. You cops don't run Evershaw West. You don't run Martinez. You don't run anything. So who does? The lady no. Hmm? He means la puta madre. Excuse me. A legendary, and not in a good uh... way, crime boss from Jamrock controls what is probably the most powerful organized crime outfit in Rift Okay, a new West. player two has entered La the Puta game. Madre. <laughs> yeah, him. Uh, <clears throat> silence, what's the name, man? Cross your arms and Then I presume not. you are familiar with his peonies. Yeah, they're his little bitches. He's got them all over the unions. Not just the unions. He has peonies everywhere. Some say he even has them in the RCM. Dirty fucking peonies who do anything for him. Multi-ethnic drug addicts. The lieutenant adopts a rodentine quality. Be cool, sire. He's getting hmm. into this. I like this. <laughs> You're not peonies. You wouldn't be investigating a drug thing if you were. No, of course not. We are not peonies. But if we were, and one of Madre's drivers were to be stealing from him, then it's a good peony's job to find out who that is. He's surprisingly good at this. Not bad at all. Look at him lurching. It's not a hard job. Can't. It won't take a long time. It won't make Padre Madre angry. But a stupid fucking racist is standing in the way, 
protecting these fucking teeth. I'm not scared of you or the mob. I'm under the protection of the Loriman and Carter's guild. You've seen that Light corpse up, in the Kim. ceramic armor there. Did his shitty little guild protect him? No, <laughs> you wouldn't just leave him out there if you... <laughs> the lieutenant turns and gives you a barely perceptible nod. Let's fucking go. Oh, I, minus yeah, one 92? For go fuck, minus one for go fuck yourself. <laughs> Worth it. Men like this Boom. only respect two things. Strength and fear. Hey, um... Behind the scenes, we haven't played this game in, in about a week since, uh, I don't know, as of 50 minutes or so ago. Um, no success chance stuff ever again, huh? Hey! It's, it's just yeah. gone forever. Time to turn what the fuck happened? Point. It has to have been something we were researching or something. Yeah, I figured it would come back after just, like saving and quitting, but no, it's still just gone. Weird, um, I completely forgot. Fuck you, I told you. I'm not gonna... Show me where the lorry is! I'm gonna fuck you! Smaller, as yours. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna put you in a cell with a giant kipped... Uh, I've been to your fucking lorry. I'm gonna burn it down. I'm gonna go... Wow, these are all very good. I'm gonna fuck you for the rest of your life. Fucking I like that. Homo cop. Look, fuck you, man. It's some lorry down there green banged up thing i don't fucking know who she is when did she go away i don't know i don't even know her name she just rules with the fleet and acts like a big shot some dyke probably i haven't even seen her for days this guy is just the worst kind of how's the monument human, down yeah. there the green i temple. wonder here's the, the oh, late game reveal this guy is okay. kudo's dad <laughs> oh the small temple by the Green. Let's get Green into tempo. that lorry. Oh. Alright. Hey, let me hit this guy with my crowbar real quick before I leave. Okay. I'm just looking at my journal real quick. Gotta... Oh, we can try the mirror again. Right, because they talked to that guy. Actually, is my electrochemistry even decent? Five, okay. This, it's a thing we put points into, so it's actually decent odds of mm -hmm. success versus a a yellow skill on the bottom there. Yeah. Alright. We got so lucky that the drug feeling one was also related to the fight goodly one. Yeah. This green foul, A to Z, contempora, is parked in the shadow of the ruins looming overhead. It's seen better days. This must be the one he told us about, unless he was lying. Unless he was lying. Right? The glass on the side windows is tinted and covered with dust. You can barely make out the shape of the seat and two steering leaf. The door is locked. The handle looks shiny, like it's recently replaced. Okay. Use the pry bar to smash the window. Open it from the inside. I don't know how okay, yeah. it is, and... but this investigation has taken long enough. We can't afford it to take any longer. Success. Okay. With a firm grip, you Hell yeah. Easily. 42, 100%. A glint of light catching on the tip. Call down the hammer of truth and justice. Release I your think we, it, I, unless there's like a hidden modifier in this game that like makes the dice rolls a lie, I feel like we've been absurdly lucky most of the time. Oh yeah, <laughs> oh yeah. Welcome to Revish. Big time. The window shatters and droplets of. And I'm sure some of it's confirmation bias, and we're only remembering the successes. But I feel like we've hit like too many of the 17 percent too. Yeah, <laughs> some there's of been those a few ones. that like. It, I, the one that we, the horrible one was that we failed that like seventy or eighty percent chance with uh, the Hardy Boys, which I think would have been really useful to like get intel mm -hmm. out of. But what are you gonna do? Sato. Uh, the okay. smell of cigarettes and perfume welcomes we you. We in there. The cabin inside is plastered with old movie posters. Actresses smile from hmm. the walls. There's a radio transmitter in the front and a toolbox tucked under the driver's seat. Well, Some tools lie scattered near the pedals. These are movie posters featuring starlets from long forgotten films from the 20s, the teens, even the 90s of the last century. Is that 60 years wow. ago? Yeah, that's, that's pretty old. One of them particularly old catches ones. your eye a centerfold of an ingenue attached right above the back seat. The actress is draped in a sheath dress, one of her shoulders bared. 
The faded remains of an autograph ran across the poster. She's looking past the camera. Wait, doesn't she resemble someone you know? Mm. But you can't put your finger on who mm. exactly. Is my, is my wife a movie star? This is Tip Tijon, oh. a starlet from the dawn of cinematography, less known for her talent than her tragic, untimely oh. death. She oh, no, wasted okay. away in a drug den called Door to the River, not far from here on Boogie Street, a mixture of cocaine and morphine. She was afraid of the world and the camera, too. Okay, so electrochemistry, I guess, recognized her because of the cocaine and morphine. Yeah. The actresses <laughs> and the rear actor all smile you a warm goodbye. A radio goodbye transmitter posters. is attached Thank you. to the dashboard. And a toolbox sits under the driver's seat. Right, so, um, I guess Looks the like the frequency dial is absent. It requires a key to work, but the key oh. has been removed. Likely by the missing lady driver. Strange. There are so many radio stations saved here. Must be over 100 at least. Huh. Uh, doesn't look like it. It's completely inoperable without the dial key. For okay, contacting an entire stations. fleet of lorrymen, for example. This is all shortwave, UW and UKV. Looks like we are dealing with an impressive organizational tool. The nerve center of a huge operation. With quite a range too. Yeah. The smell of a thousand cigarettes, some dead actresses, and a rusty old toolbox under the seat. Yes, you you wedge yourself on, yeah. under the steering wheel to get a better look. Seems like the few tools lying around here. A hammer, a pair of pliers, a rusty wrench have been casually thrown there by the disorganized driver. But one odd detail does catch your eye. A piece of sandpaper has been glued to the throttle. Weird. Sandpaper like adds grip? extra grip. Yeah, yeah nice. Okay. Uh, all right, yeah. Sandpaper. I guess I will just say this. Another <laughs> technique. The movie stars That's are it. still right. smiling from the walls. The metallic drawer slides out from the seat. It's empty, except for a folded newspaper. Damn, I was really hoping we were gonna get the, the stronger pry bar we needed for the ice cream. Yeah. Machine. It's an issue of Eddie Ferdic from last Wednesday. A piece of paper falls out from its pages. It looks like an article ripped out from a radio enthusiast magazine. Complex mathematical equations explain the basics of something called the ULAN frequency system. These formulas cool. look oddly painful. Yeah, Maybe it's the hangover, <laughs> but they give you Wow, a this headache. fucking math, dude. It's giving me a goddamn annual. The Ulan frequency system. You I know, Harry is before. not. Harry North does not strike FM me as a mathematician. UKV, but uh, excuse me. I will. I, I welcome you to look at my amazing intellect. Thank you. Uh. So I guess it's just a new. Yeah. Frequency? Okay. Well. The pull out back something they space. maybe it's something that's the getting used in secret. It was. For secret Radio, messages. Posters, yeah. A trace of motor oil smell under all the cigarettes. Well. And close the rusty old lorry door. Great. I think we got everything. A word, detective? Before we return to Joyce? Yeah, we didn't really I feel like we got pretty much nothing out of that, but you know. Alright. We finished here. Let's quickly debrief and go over what we found, so we don't do it in front of the company rep. Yeah, good call, Kim. <laughs> Honestly, I'm quite worried by what we've seen so far. The evidence seems to point to a rather extensive and well-organized operation. I'm especially intrigued by that radio transmitter, particularly the sheer number of stations it can Yeah, connect. that makes sense. Yeah, like this alleged yeah the insinuation was that, like, this, this, lorry, this well single lorry is, like, Technology prepared like to talk to the a entire fucking world. In it. Yeah. I'm not sure what the ULAN frequencies are all about, but they may hold some significance. Perhaps it's a better way to connect between fleets while avoiding frequency bleed. Or maybe it's used to tap into RCM networks. Listen yeah, that's what I was thinking. Like, calls, they use it as like a secret channel or something. Yeah, for sure. A worrying prospect. Um... Yeah, what are the movie posters? How do they fast? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. As they are. I don't think they are relevant to the drug trade. I don't know. It might be like a Shawshank and a punch behind it, and there's all your cocaine don't right be there. Fooled. 
desire. Kim notoriously doesn't think a lot of things are relevant to the investigation. Yeah, but and I, to be to his credit, I think he's probably right most of the time. Yeah. Um, sort of cinephile. Yes. Well. We didn't find anything conclusive linking them to the smuggling operation. But somehow, I doubt that Everard Clare would be oblivious to something like this happening right under his nose. My suggestion is, we use it against the Union, in any way we can, to our own ends. It's a slippery ill, but we just might be able to pin them down, indirectly, down the road. We should okay. return to the murder case, see what Joyce tells us about the lynching. When we are done for the day, I call my station and suggest our narcotics department look into it. There are more than enough grounds to start an official investigation. Sometime later, when we are done here. We do not want to get caught in that. Mm -hmm. The fact that one hasn't started already gives me pause. An investigation, I mean. Especially if the Madre grouping is involved, and I can't imagine there aren't. Uh, so. yep. All the same, I, agree, I don't like the idea of internal affairs descending on the matter. That mm. won't help anyone either. Debrief okay. over. After you. I, I wonder if that's going to turn up later that, like... The... Oh my god, I'm stuck on the stoop section all the way around to leave. <laughs> the police department, like... I don't know. They know... Yeah, what like, hasn't... On. Hasn't already done an investigation of some kind? Yeah. I also, like, don't really know... I guess we just go back to the lady and say, like, there. well, this is what we... Working class ...found trap. out. You know what this means, right? Cracked it. All in a good day's work. Oh, what do you we're mean? talking about this what guy do down I there. Yeah. Look at how working class that drunk is. <gasps> it's her husband, the missing yes. husband. And you found him. Now go and tell the working class woman. Protect and serve, recruit. Didn't she repeatedly tell you her husband isn't missing her? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going. There's no need for champagne. Yeah, you got to tell her. Honor, recruit. Go and tell the working class woman what you found right now. Hell yeah, thanks, Authority. Great news. <laughs> found your lost husband. I found your husband. God damn it, I already told you. My husband isn't missing. I found him Very well, then. Where is he? Excuse me? I, I don't follow. <laughs> I found a working class <laughs> drunk and I thought he might be yours. Right, because working class women come with alcoholic husbands. You know what? Remember, about that what. Never ever say what. What? You were right. I do have an alcoholic husband. Nailed well, it. Not that one. No, is he's he, not. Is he missing? Or maybe he is. I don't know. He's probably in the park or in Shambrock somewhere. Drinking with his friends. Aww. I haven't seen him for... Well, to hell with him. No, oh, I'm sorry, working class woman. Uh, we actually have a case now, though. I wouldn't be so sure. Ma'am, <laughs> just to be completely clear, do you want to report it to the police? Report what? He's just out drinking with his friends. I'm sure the police has better things to do than to chase down local goofballs. I just think missing persons... They're not all they cracked up to be, officer. Because people either show up on their own, or you never find them. I want a missing persons case. Right, he has questions now. What kind? Of Hell questions? yeah, we do. Honestly, like? not that different from you. <gasps> oh, thank oh. God, no. Wait it a second. It hasn't come down to this yet. Yeah, hey, yeah, I'm, I'm cool, man. Well, are he's we the husband? Slightly chubby. <gasps> what else? He was my wife. A I love you. I'm an alcoholic. <laughs> blue inner lining. <laughs> we the did it. We found our so wife. I made it myself. It's his cool jacket. God knows it's too cold to run around in this, but he refuses to change. I even tried throwing it away once, but he just dug it out of the bin. Can you believe hey, it? Hey, look, I, as the owner of a jacket that I consider my cool jacket, I completely understand her husband's point of view. What if we can't... What if we tragically can't find the husband, but we find a cool jacket? Well, what can that, you do? I mean, me. I hope that at least yeah, that's not the worst outcome, right? If anything, what that if would be the best outcome in a bad cold. situation. What if her husband is 
tragically shot by some alcoholic maniac cop. Camp? But I get you talking about over. camp? I'm talking about, someone. Talking about uh, our anyone. friend it Cam? Could be, could be anyone for all I know. Yesterday morning, he went to the Our friend library. Kim does love to shoot his to gun at children. And he promised. Yeah, he Kim's kind promised of a piece of shit. He'd walk straight back yeah. home. Because we talked about this. We talked about not wandering off again. I I don't know what to do. I honestly don't know what to do with his addiction. Just makes me feel weak. Gone for around 36 hours oh. then. Damn, this is a missing persons case. She turns away from you in an attempt <laughs> to I like that we just browbeat her into accidentally yeah. making her husband we actually be a missing play. person. Thank right. you. Please do. Case. Even though I'm sure he will return home by himself. I'm still sure of that. I'm sure he will All right. too. When he does, would you let Precinct 57, Kim Kitsuragi, know? I will, of course, officer. As I said, it's probably not... Should we tell her she was right about the cockatoo she thing? Yeah. Excuse me? I went right up on them, and so I don't know what do I... I, I don't know. I chose. The most talkative oh, one? The fuck up a two, that's right. <laughs> yeah. <What> now? <laughs> fuck up a two, it's the one who fucks everything up, man. <laughs> don't think that. You're the cockatoo who offered to find my stupid husband. Let's leave it at that. I like that we're Aww. friends now. <laughs> yeah, the working class woman likes us now. You know, I asked, have I even ever talked to this guy? Uh, nope. Okay. Well, <laughs> nope. We saw him up there. We said, "That's gotta be your husband." There he is. Detective. Once again, Harry stumbles himself into making a new friend and saving the day. So, I want to look at what new. Yeah, we didn't go we up there at all. The streets will flow red once more. A great torrent rushing down Rue de Esperance. You wait and see. Okay, that's cool. The streets will not flow red with anything. Who are you? I'm Cindy <laughs> the fucking skull. Kim's well, not fucking here now. for it. Date of birth, blood type, the last time I was tested for hep C. I am the law. Sod off, pig man. R is above the law. She turns her head to face the coast and nods disdainfully toward Joyce, performing maintenance on her boat. Okay. The woman on the boat does not notice her staring. I mean, it'd be more impressive if she did notice that, that she was being just yeah. stared at. Just somebody <laughs> staring at her. Ozon is an archipelago, two days travel away from Rivershaw. Its moneyed residents used to posh restaurants and upscale boutiques, rarely have reason to visit Montanese. On a first name basis with her, are we? Piggy's moving up in the world. Yeah. All right, Cindy. I'll, I'll get Cindy on my Pig's side. He's not half as dumb as he looks. Oh, you Can't you tell? I'm painting a beautiful mural, an aerial graffitio visible from low orbit. I haven't oh, really started be big. yet. I'm waiting for the right words. Why are you so committed to this? This place <laughs> is severely lacking in havoc. Not even the occasional trash can fire to break up the tedium. I thought I'd mix it up, you know, summon the forces of crime and social All right. chaos. <laughs> A little <laughs> rage against the machine in the bottle. I like that. Have you ever tried your hand at graffiti? When faced with a blank wall, most people write unimaginative stuff, like pigs go home and Mono is here. We rarely see pigs around here though. Just union cats. <laughs> and my name's not Mona, so. Yeah. I love public art. Yep. Thanks. I'm sure the inspiration will We are art people, we discovered. I, I just got the achievement Il Capo del Arte. So, there you go. That's funny. She means the opposite. Um, let's see. Anything but the recent murder. I ain't no snitch. Yeah. Pigstein. Pigstein. Go forth and forage in someone else's shit. No shortage Kay. of squealers in these parts. Actually, now, there is a shortage of people who... Big caveat. 
that yeah, obviously it now. sounds like this guy that got murdered was like a shithead of a human being and deserved it. But I just can't believe people's stance on not snitching about murder, you know? I you think more people would be willing to talk about murder. At least, I mean, for this area, it's like, I think they have a pretty good reason to not oh, trust the cops. For sure. You weren't put on this earth to make your life for sure. lesson. Fuck I wonder out. if that's like... No, the I'm missing probably armor! The missing armor! It. What do I care about some fucking tin eggshells? Art for the body. Ugh, Art for right. the body. Sad piggy. I'll give you this one. I saw a little <gasps> girl in the fishing village running around with military. That's girls. across the waterway, right? I think so, yeah. Cute as hell. We're gonna if get some gloves. There, Only got twelve fifty in our pocket. Coast from the main plaza. Yeah, okay. Hell, Have a good yes. time. No, no. That's all the snitching Cindy the Skull does for today. Actually, I don't even know why I told you what I just told you. I have a weakness you, for Cindy. animals. It's the animal thing again. Damn it. Or a weakness for police officers, miss. Thank you either way. Watch Thanks, your Cindy. back, Ungular. You've got eyes on you. Don't make up words. Okay. Not impressive. Oh yeah, give me the gloves. Or I, I will say I've had to Google. Like. I've had to Google a lot more words with us playing through this You're game back. than I did when we were playing Good. Resident Evil. What so can far. I help you with? Uh, let's see, yes, my eyes on the harbor have sent word to that effect. What have you discovered? Yeah, what do you mean by eyes on the harbor? Oh, probably just the mm -hmm. the guy, the rabble rouser guy. I assume. It doesn't really matter, and I do apologize for the surveillance. Wild pines can't afford to be blind at a time like this. One of the tall buildings overlooking the roundabout, most likely. Oh, that would give them a read on the entire quarter. In any case, it's a relief to know someone has looked into it. If I may ask, will there be an official investigation? I assume you discovered there is an operation. If there is an investigation, it will be part of an ongoing operation, subject to confidentiality. I am sure you understand. Of course, detectives. Thank you, Kim. In any case, you've held up your end of our arrangement. I trust you with the rest. Oh, that was now really all she turn. needed. I was worried I we didn't have enough for some reason. Yeah, yeah, I mean, but the situation like we didn't demands much, it. But whatever. If you don't, well, we, we didn't have murder, anything. I'm afraid we may have a bloodbath on our hands. The words "bloodbath" sound cold in her mouth. They taste of iron and strawberries. They yeah, taste of iron and strawberries. Between lynching and the strike. I have an indirect role to play. I'm sad to say, my employer experienced a momentary lapse of faith in me. In that moment, they elected to deploy a private military contractor as an insurance measure. They called it my security detail. They were dispatched after I relayed the union's initial offer. Every worker. A member of the board. I tried to convince my employer it was simply a piece of rhetoric or a joke. They did not appreciate the humor. Absolutely not. These mercenaries are muscle, pure and simple. They are meant to intimidate the Union into surrendering. Who are they, exactly? Cronel, an Oranese military company. As far as I know, three arrived in Martinez. They report to me sporadically, but okay. they do not answer to me. Interesting frank, that three of them are there. Our relationship uh, th is this is also if we already even knew, though. We knew there were three of them when the one was killed. And I forget who oh, said yeah, it, but someone even said that, like, they were go like, it was going to become a problem soon. Like which what she is saying, like yeah. she was deteriorating. They wear ceramic so. armor, have semi-automatic yeah. weapons, and years of combat experience. They also have trauma and stressor disorder, and no idea how to conduct themselves in an urban civilian environment. 